We are about to start the subcommittee meeting on landmarks, public siting, and maritime uses. Good morning. Yeah. I'm Council Member Peter Ku, Chair of the Subcommittee on Landmarks, Public Siting, and Maritime Uses. We are joined by Council Members Palmer, Kalos, Barron, and Rose. Today, we will be voting to modify a site selection and acquisition in the Speaker's District, LU727. Is an application submitted by the Department of Sanitation and the Department of Citywide Administrative Services pursuant to Section 197-C of New York City Charter for the site selection and acquisition of property located at 207-217 East 127th Street, Block 1792, Locks 5, and Park 28. To facilitate the location of the Department of Sanitation's Manhattan District 11 garage, Manhattan Lock Cleaning Unit, and Manhattan Lock Cleaning Unit headquarters. The committee held a public hearing on this siting on July 27. I think we have a subcommittee meeting holding on. Please be quiet. This garage will replace the existing sanitation garage located at 343 East 99th Street, which is undersized, structurally unsound, and under pressure from hospital and residential development on the block. Due to overcrowding, sanitation vehicles are currently forced to park on the street. The city will enter into a lease for property for the new facility. The property owner would, re would retrofit the existing building to accommodate employee support space, offices, and small vehicle and accessory parking. The owner will also construct a one-story building addition, which would store vehicles and includes a wash bay and mechanic bay. An outdoor parking area will accommodate up to, 25, uh, up to 24 collection trucks. The facility will have a total capacity of 41 vehicles. Although DSNY, will, although DSNY has changed the design to incorporate a more attractive facade than the original proposal, the proposed facility is still unenclosed and there are still significant concerns about the lack of a permanent, enclosed, adequately sized facility. For that reason, we will vote to approve LU727 with a, with a modification to limit the acquisition to a term of 20 years. DSNY has agreed to immediately begin planning for a permanent long-term facility to serve District 11 sanitation needs, which includes the following goals. Explore options for a permanent consolidated facility that could house multiple facilities, including District 11, District 10, District 9, and or the Manhattan Lock Cleaning Unit. Create a state-of-the-art sanitation facility they will be fully enclosed and utilize the most advanced technology in air filtration, air efficiency, uh, energy efficiency, and storm water management using the Spring Street Garage as a model. In addition, DSNY has agreed that all trucks and, in, and equipment at this new temporary facility will be fully contained within it 
No trucks or equipment will be parked on the adjacent streets. Going forward, DSMI will engage with local stakeholders on a quarterly basis. The stakeholders uh, group will include representatives uh, from Community Board 11, the local council member, the Manhattan Borough President, and additional members that the stakeholders identify. With these conditions, the speaker is in support of approval with a modification to restrict the acquisition to a 20-year term. Council, please call the roll on the vote to approve the modifications I have described. Ku. Yes. Palmer. Yes. Rose. Councilor Rose. Barron. I vote aye. Kalos. Rose? We'll hold the vote open. Yeah, just one more. Oh. Two more. Two more. Oh. Yeah, we will uh, wait, for, uh, wait for a few more minutes for the two other members to, to show up if they want to vote, yeah. 